What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel and in the video today we're gonna be taking this Supreme Fujifilm Instant Film and this Fujifilm Instax Mini 9 and I'm gonna be going to the park and taking outfit photos and trying to get some really really cool Polaroids. It is super overcast today and it's giving me a really big London vibe when there's no sun out and the overcast. Something about it it just looks really good so we're gonna try to get that same vibe today with both of these. I'm really excited about this. Let's get right into this video and go take some outfit photos and get some cool Polaroids. Okay, so I just sat down, we are at the park. I'm gonna get this all set up, the Instax Mini 9, the Supreme matching film to go with it. I've never taken actually a Polaroid photo before. Hopefully this comes out really good. And I was really not trying to get the coral colorway either. There was a lot of better colors. I wanna do this video last minute. This was really the only one they had. Here is the Instax Mini 9. This looks super, super retro. I love it. I'm actually really happy that I got the coral colorway. I think it looks really awesome and it might be the best colorway of this camera. This was not made for simple people like me. This was made for the professionals, obviously. Supreme film pack. I actually don't want to break this open. Boom, okay. And then we're gonna sh We are game. We are game now. Let me consult the map really quick. Let me consult my partner. Did I just waste a photo? Don't tell. Oh, okay, okay, we're good. This is what's supposed to be happening. Simple enough. Let's go get the outfit photos, see how it works. Boom, so the Polaroid is coming out now. I think you shake it. I think that's what I've seen most people, the vintage retro people do, is they shake the Polaroid. For whatever reason, it seems like it makes it go faster. It's only been a few seconds and it's already coming out super cool. I usually take photos on my iPhone. This is literally a whole new level, especially with that Supreme branding right here on the bottom. And then I can take a photo of this and post on my Instagram, anything like that. It also has this light blue washed out kind of effect. I don't know if it's gonna change change over time as I let it sit. That could totally be because I put this to the cloudy set, but I think it was a success. And I'm gonna take some more and see what I can come up with. Three. Boom. And there is photo number three, and we start the shaking. All right, photo three just taken. This one, I decided to do a laying in the grass style. I thought it would look pretty cool with all of the trees and the greenery behind me. It is still too early to tell. Gotta sh shake it to develop the photo. Also, the settings on this Instax are really weird. They have cloudy, sunny, but it really wants to just do it itself. And it keeps resetting to this home one up here. Even though we're not taking photos of a home, there is photo three, Supreme Branding. And this one came out so super, super dark in the background, and it's not even fully done. I think this one is gonna be almost impossible to see. Let's try to get the rest of them done. Cool. Photo number four? Yeah, photo number four. Shake, 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 we gotta shake them out, let's go. Photo number four, I think this one is gonna be a good one. It is getting darker outside. The London vibe that I was going for earlier is getting too London vibe. I think I'm gonna do my last photo, which will be photo number five, and then we'll look at all the photos and see how they turned out and see the Supreme Polaroids are worth the hype. And photo number five is done. Photo number five just finished. It is looking really, really good, super crispy. I think this one, honestly, especially with the sky, is gonna look awesome. That color contrast on the sky. This thing really did kill it today. This Instax Mini 9 is such a cool little add-on camera, really for anyone, especially if you take like little Instagram photos, regular photographer, boom. I'm gonna put all of these photos together in one setting so you can check them out. But I think these turned out really amazing. I hope you enjoyed watching. Okay, so this is how all of them turned out. And then if we can zoom, they turned out so amazing, you guys. Can't believe it. I'm really excited. These are all five Polaroids that I took. And I think the colors really came out amazing on these. That was pretty much it. Let me know what you guys thought of the Polaroid shoot that I did today. If it was cool, if you enjoyed, let me know in the comments. And as always, much love.